Good morning, my darlings. So guys, in case you didn't know, I'm in Bali. Ah! Not just me, me and Sam are in Bali. Um, we've been here for a week now. I'm really, really sorry I haven't vlogged, but it's just been so chaotic. We literally haven't slept in a week. We've just got our sleep in like, okay. So it's been quite chaotic, but I'm gonna vlog today with you. I'll do, I'll do a little tour of our villa and I'm just gonna vlog the day. So we've just got ready and we're going to have a breakfast to our favorite place. It's called Crate in Changu. If you know, you know. So, so delicious. And yeah, I'm starving. So we're gonna go there. This is the fit of the day. If you can see, I've got a play suit, jumpsuit, what do you call it? Is it a jumpsuit or a play suit? I don't know. Let me know what you think in the comments. From GoGG, this is linked on my TikTok, I've got it in this colour, I've got it in black, I've got it in um, grey and I've got it in blue. So comfy, so good. This little crossbody bag from Primark. If you are going away guys and you need like a little crossbody bag, I 100% recommend these. They've got the waterproof as well. They've got a green one, a black one, a cream one and I don't know. I wanted the cream one but it was sold out. And then just Crocs and Sunnies. So yeah, this is the fit to go out for breakfast so here is the entrance to our villa that's where you walk in little stepping stones so cute our sunbeds please ignore our trainers drying this is our pool our private pool so so nice it's giving like i'm a celebrity vibes so nice and then we have our kitchen please ignore the mess but here is the kitchen area just outside chilling and then we just have a little seating area that's just full of shopping bags we're not the tidiest guys, sorry. And then it's just another little seating area. Let's say this is the living room. We actually sit here a lot, a lot. Then you open the doors and this is the bedroom. TV, there's literally mess everywhere, please ignore. And the bed, comfy. And then, yeah, and then the roof. And if you can see just there, there is a little gecko just chilling. There he is. Just chilling, geckos do come in and out, but they're literally harmless. So we just kind of let them, yeah. Simon's brushing his teeth. Here's the bathroom, bit messy again. Hanging up all our clothes, shower, toilet, and yeah, gives a wave. So yeah, that is literally, that is the tour. I would 100% recommend staying here if there's two of you, obviously, only if it's two people, but I would 100% recommend it. It was crazy cheap, but everything here is, it's actually insane how cheap it is here. Like it's another world. Um, but yeah, I would definitely recommend it. The location is really, really good because you're not in the center center because when you're in the center center, there's just cars beeping nonstop. It's quite crazy. So, yeah guys, let's go and get some breakfast. Sam has just gone, he's gone on his little bike. I'm way too scared to get on the bikes because they are mental. So I'm now just walking to the supermarket. 
guys the roads the roads are just insane if you can't hear me it's because there's motorbikes everywhere even on the pavement i'll insert a clip now of what it's like walking on the pavement bikes just drive past you it's oh my god it's crazy but once you've been here for like a few days you kind of get it but yeah so my plan was i was gonna walk to starbucks because they've got loads of like funky drinks here so i was gonna do like a taste test of barley starbucks drinks i've done a oh my gosh sorry guys it's so loud i've done a barley um taste testing fruit video uh, on my tiktok this is my tiktok by the way so make sure you go and watch that so yeah i think i'm gonna go now and i'm gonna get some... oh my god it's so loud right it's got a bit quiet now <laughs> i'm gonna go and get some um drinks that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna get a um selection of different drinks and i'm gonna do a taste test video and i'm gonna put it on my tiktok so like i said make sure you follow me on tiktok i will put a few clips on here oh my gosh it's so lo <gasps> look at this guy look at this look at him guys people here are just crazy <gasps> and also i searched this it's 17 to drive here but i've seen school children driving that can't have been any older than 11 driving here so <laughs> yeah it's mad but i do love it guys it's so hot these are all the fruits that i've like already taste tested the best by far are these baby mangoes unreal look at the size of the avocados they're like melons I taste tested these snake fruits and they were actually pretty good to be fair so I do recommend trying them. These were my favourite. These were my absolute favourite. Mangus? Mangus? These were really good but you literally got hardly anything inside but really good. I mean is that not just the most weirdest bunch of bananas you've ever seen in your life? These are all like the funky ice lollies like avocado ice <laughs> I think I'm gonna do a fruit roll-up video with some crazy ice creams because chocolate and avocado what on earth right I've seen these everywhere so I'm gonna get some I'm gonna get strawberry I'm gonna get pineapple Actually, I'm just going to get strawberry and pineapple for now because I don't want to get loads and I don't like them all. I'll get those two and then... Oh my God, what is that? Grass jelly. Not a clue, but let's get it. Looking at some of these actually make me really nervous. Like, what's this? Jasmine green tea drink. Let's give it a try. What on earth is that? It's got bits in it. What is it? I guess I'm gonna try it. Okay, so I've got these so far. So they're quite a good variety. Very scared of this panda. Also gonna try this, not quite sure. Guys, there's so much like funky. It's obviously not funky, but it's funky for me because obviously I'm from the UK. So there's so much like crazy stuff here. Like there's some really cool snacks really cool sweets and oh my god oh my god okay guys i think we've got everything i got two cokes just um to be safe but i've got quite a few drinks there so let's go and pay also guys i'm gonna pick up these because there's loads of little stray dogs and i just want to feed some of them okay guys it was uh, 198,000, which is sorry, I just worked out my calculator. Ten pound thirty-one. Ten pound thirty-one buzzing. Um, something I will say: if you are coming to Bali, or if you've been to Bali, you already know. 
it's cheaper to literally eat out. Like me and Sam thought, because we're getting a villa, we'll go to the supermarket, you know, buy food, cook meals. No, the supermarket's the most expensive part. So going out and eating is so much cheaper. So we've literally gone out and ate every single breakfast and dinner. And yeah, it's so much cheaper. Right guys, I'm gonna call a taxi now and then um, we're gonna go back to the villa and we're gonna do some taste tests of some drinks. It's so hot. I might do a cheeky sunbathe as well. Right guys, I've got the treats. So let's see if we walk past some doggies. Okay guys, so the dogs that I saw, I saw two dogs when I went to go and get those treats. They both had collars on. Um, that's the thing, a lot of the dogs here do have collars on, so they do have owners, but they just sort of wander around Bali, which, you know, good for them. But anyway, I came out, I saw them, and I literally walked up to them, and their owner went, and they ran off, so that's great. So hope that I go past some more dogs, because I've got a bag full of treats now so hopefully we'll find some more not interested not interested i'll leave it there i'll leave it there right so not only do the dogs walk off the dogs actually aren't asked about the treats <laughs> that dog was just like didn't even want to look at me i mean all right also guys when we were on our tour the tour guide did say to us dogs are very like respected here they're like considered like you know kind of a priority so i was like oh my gosh really because there are you, you see quite a few just wandering around but most of them do i'd say 90 percent of them do have collars on and shops do have um like food bowls outside which is so nice and yeah i've tried to feed them and they don't give a shit guys just got back to the villa let's get in i'm gonna put all the drinks in the fridge because i just think the taste test will be so much better if they're in the fridge so yeah i'm gonna put drinks in the fridge i'm gonna chill for a bit i might sunbathe for a little bit and then i'll come back i'll come back so guys i've just had a shower and washed my hair the water over here absolutely terrifies me and yes we have got a shower filter but i'm too scared to wash my hair with um the water even with the filter on so i use um bottled water which actually sounds like it'd be really hard and it's actually really easy just two big bottles of water and i'm done so yeah just wash my hair just put my jammers on but just put some like skincare and moisturizer on um because it was quite cloudy um the sun has now came out <laughs> So I want to sunbathe, but I can't because, you know, you know, I've got all my lotions and potions on. So that's great. Um, I'm going to film the drinks taste test now. I think I'm going to go through the drinks really quickly. First of all, we have Mongo Mongo Minimum. This one's kind of scary because it's got like jelly in it, but hey i'm all for trying uh, this one i've seen these all over tiktok they're the ones where you pop the little ball in i'm pretty sure um these are actually japanese i think but they're all over barley i've seen them in every single supermarket so i've got one of these in don't know what that says one of these in pineapple i'm excited for this one this one i'm really really scared for this is a cap panda grass jelly drink and i know pandas eat grass so is it gonna literally be I don't know, it says grass jelly. Oh, I don't know. That one scares me. And then finally, an A and W Rasa Saris Pravalida. I don't know what I'm saying. But yeah, that one's next. So let's give it a go. Here we go. The Mongo Mongo Minimum. Oh. Okay, the juice, nice. The jelly, vile. Like, mm -mm. I don't like that jelly. No, 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 no. No. Guys, I had a camera malfunction, so I could only film it for my TikTok, but they were all awful. Awful. Go to my TikTok and watch the full video. Just disgusting. So anyway, now I'm going to go and I'm going to edit some videos. I'm going to chill. I'm going to have a nice drink. I'm going to have a freezing cold can of Coke. Oh, stunning. See, at home, I'd never have a Coke. Like, 
Literally never. But when I'm on holiday, something changes. Good morning, my darlings. I'm so sorry about the lighting, but I'm literally in the... You know what? Forget it. I'm going to move. I'm going to move. Good morning, my darlings. Right. I was sorry about the lighting. Now, I'm really sorry about this. Let me just show you what you're working with here. This is the fit. <laughs> just, girls, if you know, you know. I washed my hair. I washed my hair last night and um, today we're actually going to Finn's Beach Club, which I'm really excited about. And I wanted my hair to be a little bit wavy. And what better way to get waves overnight? This. So yeah, guys, um, last night, sorry I like didn't really end the vlog. I just kind of stopped filming. But it was because um, we were going to go out some food, but we decided to stay in because we were really, really tired. Um, so we literally just ordered some food, watched a movie and went to bed. So nothing really fun about that so then i decided oh oh i'll vlog today because we're going to finn's beach club if you don't know what it is finn's beach club is it's supposed to be the best beach club in the world i don't know but we're gonna go and we're gonna see it has been very expensive not gonna lie um actually it's not very expensive but it's expensive compared to everything else here so we've paid 170 pound each each and that is for um a vip bed but the bed is for six people because they didn't have any um smaller beds available so that's why it's so expensive but you do get that back on food and drink so it's actually it's actually a pretty good deal but yeah i'm gonna take you along with us and we'll just see what Finn's Beach Club is about so right now sam has gone to the gym i'm gonna chill for a bit i've been bitten there I've been bitten there. I don't know how, I don't know when, but that's just so inconvenient. I'm gonna go through my emails. I've woken up and I've got like 70 emails. So that's great. Um, and then we're gonna go for some breakfast. We're gonna go to this place called Rise and Shine, which I've seen on uh, Instagram quite a bit, quite a bit. So we're gonna go to Rise and Shine and then we're gonna go straight to Finn's. Also, I need to figure out what I'm gonna wear to Finn's because you know, I want to look nice. It does look like it's going to be absolutely scorching today. Which is actually kind of good. I love the sun. But, yeah, guys. I'll see you in a bit. So, guys, this is the fit. If you can see. Dress is in the style. Yeah, and I've got a costume on underneath. Look how long it is. Look how long it is. Love the hair. Taking out from flats. Glasses of Ray Ban, and we're getting ready to go. It's so hot though. I'm actually quite nervous because it's so hot in this hair. It's a little bit of Hermione Granger. It's like an orange line. Are you ready? Not too strong. Quite sweet. Need a bit more chili in there. Ellie. 